My name is Suwarum David Milton Rizling Baldy. My first name is Suwarum and it is a village site in Karoo country. My second name David is from my great grandfather. He, his name too was Suwarum David. Uh, Milton is my father's dad's name, my grandpa's name. Uh, Rizling is my mother's last name and Baldy is my dad's last name. I am a uh, Hoopa, Yurok, and Karuk. I grew up in Arcata, California, and I've lived here um, pretty much my whole life, except for when I went off to college at the Art Institute of California, San Francisco. I make regalia, I make just art for fun. One good thing about coming from my family is that they're really involved and they participate a lot in their dances. So I've always really been just surrounded by really nice stuff. I can remember my father when I was really young we'd, be, we'd go off to like the jump dance and the deerskin dance. He just helped lay the stuff out and you really get to get a nice view when, when you're just hanging out there in between dances and all the stuff's laid out. It, as long as you're not over there like shaking everything and trying to break stuff you can look at it as long as you want. You really just have all this time in the day when you're not dancing well, one of the first pieces I made was a necklace for my auntie. It was um, just a one-strander. I really had no idea what I was doing. We were sitting around, I think we were at language camp in Hoopa, and we had to make something. So we made one of these necklaces, and I gave it to my auntie, and then her being her, she said thank you, and she, you know, she really likes it, and she uses it to this day. I made necklaces, I'm starting to make feathers, I've been doing carving. I just started making an eel basket, made flower dance sticks. It's just a long process, which was just fun. Indians really, up in Northern California, really felt that their whole role was to be caretakers of the land. When you're talking about things like the Kahenai, our spirit people, when they left, they, they went into all of the other rocks, trees, birds, fish, everything. So it really connects you to those things. When you would kill a woodpecker or you would kill something, you, you're using it and you're going to use it and you're going to honor it for the rest, the rest of your, you know, your son's lives, the rest of your son's and son's' lives. Twin in the old twin tet. Grow old in a good way. Hyanontic. The end.